Hey guys, it's another Gypsy Soul, and I am your host for Monday on Witchcrafting Channel, and it is a privilege for me to be here. This is one of the first channels that I ever started watching when I started um, exploring my pagan path, and it hooked me from the very beginning. These women that are on here are total sweethearts, and... And they inspire me because if you watch my channel, Another Gypsy Soul, you know that I love arts. So you may be looking at this and saying, but Dana, what does some color pencils, some morning glories, a pencil sharpener, what does that have to do with anything and a bucket of dirt? Well, it has a lot to do with it because... Um, to be able to use your color books or to write in your books of shadows or anything else, you will need something to write with. And as with anything, it, pencil nature, you're going to get some dull points, and so you will have to sharpen it. Well, the act of sharpening your pencils produces this. And these are the shavings that I save um, from sharpening my pencils. And um, I started thinking about it. And I even pulled in the wonderful Molly Roberts and asked her her opinion on it. And we both came up with the same thing. If by sharpening those pencils, you're putting creativity and intent into that, those sharpenings from the, the pencil are imbued with those same intentions. Um, and what a wonderful thing to be able to pass it on to your flowers. So I did this last year, and um, my morning glories bloomed into the wintertime. And um, this year I chose, instead of chose, I chose, I have chosen the multicolored morning glories instead of the, um, just the one color. And what you're going to do is, I have a long container and with it being Louisiana, I don't have to start mine inside. I can start them outside. Um, and I have some of Nadia's beautiful uh, goddess Bridget. Um, incense burning but you will just dig you a little trench all along inside of here and then you will scatter your seeds Okay, and then once your seeds are in there, you will take some of your colored pencil shavings, and you can either do it before or after, it doesn't matter, but you want to take them and work them between your hands just to get them a little bit finer. Oops, it'd help if I'd be on frame, huh? And just go along, spreading those in there and having your mind intent of beauty, of creating beauty by creating a beautiful patch of soil full of your choice of flowers. And then, once you get those in there, you're going to take your dirt and you're going to pull it back over the top like so. It's not rocket science, but you have to have intent. Pat that down on there. Not too hard, but just to get it in there, pat it down. And then we're going to hit it with some water. And we are also into here 
going to add, because I always do this, some of my crystals from my Arkansas trip. And I'll just plop a few here and there in my pot. And there you go. It will be a colorful pot before you know it. So, as I said before, guys, it's a pleasure for me to be here. And I hope to be making many more videos for y'all. And I hope to see you again soon. Blessed be, guys. Bye.